Today, a survey said that nearly half of us wouldn't buy an electric car, despite we all know, of course, that it is much better for the environment. Yeah, so what about a smaller, easier to charge electric vehicle? Something like this, oh. maybe? Well, as Tim Peake's been finding out, the Sinclair C5 could be about to take us back to the future and make a return to the roads. I feel like I'm on tomorrow's world. <laughs> Many of us are looking for new ways to travel. There's a new inflatable scooter for commuters in Japan. Electric unicycles are appearing across Europe. And the first flying taxis are being tested in Singapore. I've heard about a new electric bike, but could the future of commuter transport actually be inspired by our past? I'm sure many of you remember the Sinclair C5, an absolute 80s icon, the future of transportation as it was back then. It's actually a huge amount of fun to drive. The C5 is a three-wheeled bike with an electric motor to boost pedal power. It was designed by Sir Clive Sinclair. It's ideal for shopping, for you know, going to the office, going to the station, going to school. Clive is a British electronics pioneer who also gave us calculators, the Spectrum home computer, and the world's first pocket TV. I'm meeting Clive's nephew, Grant Sinclair. He's also an inventor and has been inspired by his uncle's C5. They feel really nippy and responsive. What top speed can you get out of them? Well, it's limited to, um, to 50 miles an hour, but, but it feels a lot faster when you're this close to the ground, doesn't it? The test pilot in me would love to uh, take it to full speed, corner it, and see at what point you actually roll over. We used to get them up on two wheels, but I'm not going to try it now. I was, I was a lot younger at the time. <laughs> <laughs> when Grant was nine years old, he got to test out the first C5. I come from a family of inventors and artists, so always lots of prototypes around and, and stuff going on. Really, really quite, quite crazy stuff going on at times. Who owned these? Um, but I remember Elton John having one. Prince William had one. Paul Daniels used to have one as part of his magic show. <laughs> Early sketches reveal the C5 was initially designed with a roof. This sketch has never been shared with the public before, but Grant's learnt from the lessons of the past. Why do you think they weren't more successful? A lot of people get put off cycling when it, when it rains. You haven't got the cycle infrastructure that you have of today, so previously you feel a bit intimidating riding alongside cars and lorries and things like that. But 30 years after the original C5, the electric trike could be making a comeback. This is Iris. Grant has reinvented the C5 for today's commuters. So what are the main design features that differentiate this from the C5? Well, this is um, much higher off the ground than the C5. I wanted you to be able to ride it in traffic without feeling too intimidated. The whole thing is made out of a very lightweight foam, which protects the rider in, a, in an accident. Wow, that, I mean, that feels really strong it's and very, very, very lightweight. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's also much more aerodynamic because it's got the canopy and it's obviously weatherproof. Because the Iris is a three-wheeled electric bike, it can be used in cycle lanes and on the road by anyone over the age of 14. What does Clive think of this? Uh, he's seen video and images of it and he, he likes it, yeah. I've heard he likes it. So. <laughs> OK, here we go. Time to test it. I'm going to be one of the first to drive this prototype. Straight away, that's a nice pickup. A lot of acceleration, surprisingly fast. It can reach speeds of up to 30 miles an hour and only takes 60 minutes to charge. Test the brakes. Nice. Although the £5,000 price tag is quite steep, Grant is hoping to start production in the next six months. How did it feel? That was a lot of fun, Grant. Thank you very much. It's, it's great to, to let you test it. <laughs> it's too early to tell if the Iris will be a success but Grant is triumphantly carrying on the Sinclair inventing trend. Looks cool, doesn't Well, it? I like that there's a roof on that one. <laughs> you like that one better, do you? Yeah, well, it brings a lot, yeah. Yeah. You couldn't work that one properly. Anyway, Will Bailey is back with us. Will, fancy you go on that one? 
I love that. It's cool, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I'd be well up for that. Yeah, it's five They go faster you. than they look, well, yeah. I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah. I'm just it's saying. Cool. I'm just pedalling. <laughs> <laughs>